Hello, today I'm going to show you how can you set default calendar template for project for the web. If we go to new project, I'm on the, in the project for the web, and I create blank project, okay, I will get untitled project, and if I click on untitled project, you will see after some time, okay, and I hope it will be the short time, here you can put your, the name of project, and here you will see that the fourth work, uh, work template is uh, template for calendar, and I can choose among two of them, default work template and creation time zone, which I already created. So what if I don't want to, do, uh, to have default work template, because sometimes I will forget it, and when I, cho uh, when I choose to uh, change it afterwards, it will be too late, or I will have different results, etc., etc. So it can be embarrassing. So I'm going to delete this project. I just wanted to show you default. And how can I do this? OK, let's open another tab and go to powerapps, make.powerapps.com. And I will be here, and I am going to choose apps here and I will choose project. So I'm going to project. You will see that project is in Dynamics family, so I am here and I have my project accelerator, but don't worry, if you don't have it, you will, uh, you will get the same result if you follow these steps. I don't need project, I need settings. So I will click here, I will go to settings, and you will see that I have here my organization unit. You can have multiple of them, but I, will, I have only one, so I am going to choose that one. I will check it here, and I go to Edit. So, Parameters, Organizational Unit checked, and Edit. And you can see here that I can choose, do I want that by default my schedule mode is in fixed duration, fixed effort, and fixed units, which I covered in some of my previous video. But here, I will concentrate on this. So you can see default work template. But since I work in Croatia and I have my Croatian work, work template, I will not choose this one. I will raise this one. And I will click once here. And I can choose it. Or I can just try to write the first letters of the name of the template, and I have here Croatian, Croatian time, time zone template from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. If I want to see how does it look, I can click on it, okay, and it will be opened here, and you will see that I use resource template for Croatian time zone. Everything is explained in my videos in, in section project for the web. This is just a video about how to set the template. OK, but anyhow, I will go to template resource, OK, from creation template. And I have a, a, a wait a little bit uh, before it's loaded. And when I wait, 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 and wait, I will have uh, my uh, choose to uh, possibility to choose the working time. So let's see what we will have. Finally, it's here. So you can see that I choose GMT plus one. So my town here, time zone, Zagreb here, Croatia. And if I go to work hours here, I will show you just on one. I can see that it is from 9 a.m. So let me click on this. Let me edit just this event because all events are the same. From 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. and the same time zone. And I will save it. OK, now let's go back to parameters. OK, here. Let's go back to projects. Let's go back to settings. And let's go back to parameters, OK? And let's edit it, OK? And I have creation time zone, OK? Now, if I save it and close it, OK? And if I go to my project once again, and if I go to new project, blank project, what will I have? I will have untitled project. If I click on it, you will see after a while, I can put here the name, 
And after a while, after a while, after a while, I had this. That creation time zone template is default template. So this is very good thing to do, especially if you use most of the times uh, the same calendar template, so you will avoid the situation in, in which you are uh, going to forget to choose the right template and uh, you don't have to, uh, to change the, for example, like in my case, from default to creation uh, time zone uh, every single time. So it is very easy and very useful. And it, is, it can be doing by, once again, power apps, in apps, choose the project, okay, choose the settings, okay, and when you choose the settings, choose your organization, click on edit, and here, change the time zone. Hope this helps. Thank you very much.